All right. So just want to do another quick tip today. Um, this one's going to be on like the loft feature. So one quick tip is that essentially you want to have the same number of entities in each sketch that you're lofting between. All right. To keep them from being twisted, you just make sure that you select near the endpoint of whatever entity you kind of want to make those connectors between. But that's not the real, the real tip here. The one that I wanted to show you is a little bit hidden. So let's say I wanted to change the shape partway through. What we can do is right click on the loft feature and you get the option to add a lofted section. If you want it in a specific place, what you could do is roll back before the loft, grab like your right plane, and then I'll just use control to drag out and get my offset plane here. I'll roll in here, there's my plane. Right click, add lofted section. You can say use selected plane here. And you can see it creates a sketch for me of that lofted section. And the cool thing about that is that I can come in now, find that sketch, edit that feature, and I can just drag these entities or change the profile however I want. Kind of fun. Hopefully that helps you guys. Have a great day.